Hi, my name is Jackie Robinson. I'm the current Vice Mayor for the City of Pasadena and have served Council District 1 for the last eight years as a member of the City Council. I'm running for mayor because I want Pasadena to be the most progressive and innovative and creative city of the 21st century. I'm also running for mayor because I believe it's time that everyone in Pasadena can see themselves and their values and their needs reflected in the policies coming out of City Hall. I'm proud to be endorsed by the Los Angeles Democratic Party as well as United Teachers Pasadena and a host of other organizations and individuals. As mayor, I'm committed to decreasing violence across the city, maintaining and increasing our affordable housing stock, as well as preserving the best of our past while looking forward to our future. I'm humbly asking for your vote on Tuesday, March 10th, and ask that you vote for me, Jackie Robinson, for mayor. Thank you. Pasadena is slowly recovering from the economic recession that took place starting in 2007. I'm proud to have been instrumental in the City Council passing a balanced budget for the last three years. However, the next mayor will have the significant challenge of restoring public trust in light of the current embezzlement issue we are working through. I have been supportive of the Mayor Bogart's efforts to appoint a citizen task force as well as appoint the ad hoc committee of the City Council to examine why the embezzlement happened and more importantly to demonstrate and institute protocols to ensure that it never happens again. It's important that City Hall maintain full transparency not just on this issue but all other issues so that our citizens can have trust in City Hall and know that the decisions that we are making are in the best interest of this city. I've been a member of the City Council for the last eight years and Vice Mayor for the last two years. I'm proud of the record I've built of being a hands-on, engaged, visible and present council member for issues not just pertaining to District 1, but citywide. On the City Council, my leadership positions and experience have included member of the Legislative Policy Committee, member of the Economic Development and Technology Committee, Commissioner to the Burbank Bob Hope Airport, Chair of the Public Safety Committee, as well as Chair of the Foothill Workforce Investment Board. It's going to be important that our next mayor be an individual who can work not just collaboratively with our city council members, but also with partners in our region. Pasadena has a reputation of being the best, and we have to maintain that by continuing to keep the relationships with our nearby city partners, as well as a mayor who is respectful of the opinions and the needs of other council districts, and I believe I've built that reputation amongst my colleagues on the City Council. As mayor, I'm committed to implementing a focused effort on Pasadena north of the 210 freeway from east to west all the way across the city. I've long be believed that these areas have been underserved and believe it will take a focused effort to improve the business districts like North Lake Avenue, continuing on Lincoln Avenue, as well as the East Washington area and the East Colorado area to improve the quality of life and improve the business districts in those areas of the city. I've started this with the implementation of the Lincoln Avenue specific plan and it has been instrumental in changing some of the long-standing negative land uses along the Lincoln Avenue corridor and we're now seeing new eateries and other businesses that are complementary to the existing businesses on Lincoln Avenue like Perry's Joint so that the neighborhoods can thrive and become more walkable and user-friendly to the existing neighbors. I'm also committed to maintaining and increasing our affordable housing stock by amending our second unit ordinance. The Rose Bowl is a historical and cultural icon of our city and one of the major venues that places us on a world stage. We have to remain committed to ensuring that it's used in a responsible manner that is complementary to both the needs of the city as a whole, as well as the quality of life of the residents that are immediately adjacent to the bowl. Um, in years past, this city has voted against using the stadium as an NFL venue, and I'm committed to ensuring that that continues to occur, occur in the future. We do need to continue to address public safety and nuisance concerns that emanate as a result of displacement events, and I believe that the city council should maintain our existing policy of 12 e displacement events per year with the option of possibly approving an additional two provided those two events um, are able to address the public safety and nuisance concerns of the neighbors immediately adjacent to the venue. 
As current vice mayor and hopefully future mayor, I will remain committed to public safety across every corner of our city. In 2007, when there was a high number of shootings across the city, similar to the current state of affairs, I founded the 2020 Initiative, which is a coalition-based effort to provide much-needed services to gang-impacted youth and their families. Today, the 2020 Initiative continues and has provided employment, career opportunities, mental health services, as well as a reintegration roundtable to those returning to our community from the prison system. I'm committed to maintaining and ensuring that every member of our community has a true opportunity to be positive members of our community, and we will continue that by ensuring that our public safety uh, employees are adequately and competitively paid, as well as um, making sure that we have positive relationships and continue in the community policing model that we have started with our police department and that we can continue to improve on. I'm running for mayor because I love Pasadena and I know that you do too. I'm committed to working with you and the other stakeholders of our community to resolve our most pressing challenges. I'm proud to be supported by the Los Angeles County Federation of Labor and the Los Angeles County Democratic Party as well as a host of other individuals and organizations. I'm humbly asking for your vote on Tuesday, March 10th and invite you to learn more about my campaign at www.jackyrobinson4mayor.com. Thank you.